must have been um, 1980. We were in Austria. And there, like in most of Europe, you don't need a car. You use public transportation. So I think it was on the bus or on the underground train, which is so romantic in, in Europe, you know, England, the, the tube, they call it. And there was this punk couple, and that was really common back in the day. A couple in love, and they were wearing matching costume, black, and intentionally different. They had both had the male and the female uh, multiracial couple, a, a black girl and a white man. And they were both wearing black lipstick, which stands out. It's a common thing back then that you would do something different. And that was different. Both were wearing black lipstick, which so they were matching each other. It's weird, but they're matching and they're they're loving to each other, which was something beautiful. It was sincere love. I could see it. I could see the look in the girl. She needed the love from him. The, you know, and then he was validating her. They were validating each other in a way, that unique way. You understand, we're different from others. We're, in the eyes of society, we're obnoxious. We're wearing black lips, but we're both wearing it. And we love each other so much, we don't give a crap what anybody thinks. We like it that people think we're deviant and, and antisocial. That's that feeling. We enjoy it. And we validate each other. That's all we need. We love it that way, that we validate each other and our love stands to the contrast of the hate we get from society. I knew back then when I saw that something special, now I understand what it is. I understand how important being validated is. Tom Hanks in Castaway is validated by a ball called Wilson that has his handprint on it that he imprints on and he risks his life to save Wilson when he has uh, uh, triggered and throws it away because he says, I'm, I'm in the middle of the ocean, and I'm talking to a ball, he throws it away, and then he feels so bad, he chases, swims, gets off his life raft, and chases in shark-infested waters to save the life of the volleyball named Wilson. He brings it back, and he says how he misses, how sorry he is that he threw it away. Do you understand the importance of having some object or being who validates you? In odds with the entire society, we validate each other and the whole world can go screw itself because all we need is each other. That is the most beautiful love story ever and I witnessed it and now years later so if that was 1980 40 what was it, 2024 44 years later I'm getting what that really was and what I've lived through makes me understand it in a way I think is unique the love story and I was just telling somebody the love affair between the wolf and the moon, and the wolverine. You could never touch the moon. But it's always there. 
And it's better to want something than to have it. Hmm. I love you.